In this video, let's take a look at installing a modified Milturn machine environment. First, you want to make sure that everything is closed. So a uh, code expert could have the machine open. I want to close that. If you have that machine active in Mastercam, you want to close that. You can go to the machine tab, design, and then new to clear that out so that the machine is not active. You also want to clean out the temp files. That's part of the unpack of the machine. The file path on this could vary. You're going to want to go to machine type mill and look at the path here. You can go to manage list and look at the path that your machine is using. You want to go to that path. I'm going to go to the default path. So default path, I'm going to browse on my computer, this PC, C drive, users, public, public documents, your master cam version, mill turn, machines. Once again, your path may vary, but that's the default from install. And then you'll see here that if we've been using the machine, there'll be this temp unpack folder here. Now, if you have custom tool libraries or something saved in here, you may want to back them up first or not delete them. Otherwise, I'm going to delete this folder. That's that temporary unpack folder. Now, I'm ready to install my post. I find the email with, in which the post was delivered. I save the post to my desktop. To install, I simply just drag the file into my master cam. Because the file already exists on your system, you're going to want to apply this action to all following conflicts and then replace the file. You should get a successful message. Now, this should just work on new jobs. If you want to uh, make sure you have all the most recent updates on existing jobs, you may want to reload the machine before continuing to work. I will close my code expert for that. Go to my files load the machine. You may need to regenerate some tool paths. Now your new version of your post should be ready to go.